Democracy at second level is something that can be quite challenging in terms of uh, how the school model is typically set up. The way it's supported in Educate Together schools is through student councils, student assembly model which some of the schools are trialling and testing out so that's a little bit different in that all of the students will have a say and they'll all meet together rather than having representatives which is how the student council work. The student council works by, um, they have two representatives from each class and they take the ideas and questions that the class has to the teachers and other student council members. We, people do a speech in front of their year group and then we will vote in our representatives and then they go on and they go to meetings and they discuss student issues. Uh, they really encourage us to, you know, stand up for what we think is right and know our human rights and responsibilities. The students are well able to articulate their views, their opinions, they're uh, well able to disagree with people in a respectful way. So those are all really helpful skills that, you know, students and young people need going into either a career or onto further education. So absolutely I would see the schools as developing uh, people as, you know, students as whole, rounded individuals.